greetings. It's Monday. Am I the only one that Mondays are a bit slow for you? Like, it's a bit slow for you to get into the routine, the program, because mostly on the weekend, you know, I am on my own program. <laughs> and during the week, I'm on someone else's program, so... It's a bit slow getting into the program, but I wanted to come on here and let you guys know that it is my birthday month and it is Bashmi's birthday month too because I opened the store in July a couple years back. And because it is our birthday month, I'm going to have like a weekly sale or special that will be taking place and throughout July I will also be listing a few new items to the store. One of those things will be the Flourish Herbal Tea. I get a lot of inquiry about that. I do share the recipe on here. But it's a lot of herbs to buy and some people just want to buy it pre-made so i'm going to make that available so i think that is one of the first new things i want to um come with i'm not sure yet so i got the containers and everything ready for it to go so i'm gonna see how that goes i also have a twinkle twinkle eye serum and a few other things so stay tuned so i don't know stay tuned each week it will be something new some special or percentage off for this week which is the first week starting today it is 15 percent off when you buy two items and more so we're warming up so stay tuned i'm excited for this as well so yeah other than that you know just here living life uh, being amazed and enlightened each day like each day I learn something new you know about life about myself about others I try to stay present in the moment because sometimes we get very lost in our head you know we're up there thinking and the present moment is passing you by because you're probably thinking about something that already happened that you cannot change and you're making the present moment now just wither away so I'm trying to make a conscious effort to stay present in the now and not to get too lost up in my head you know and not taking things personal not taking people personal not taking their actions or their words personal you know not taking that on that is another thing that I've been practicing and these things have just helped me to maneuver throughout life with out you know all that grief and sorrow and regret and hate and anger you know because these things are not healthy for us it really isn't these things that we harbor inside of us that is what caused these disease you know and these illness and sickness because you're harboring all this hate within you you know and this anger within you so if you can find a way how to not take things personal and people personal, it will help you out a lot. Everyone has to travel their own journey and you're not going to just get up one day and say, I'm going to do this and it's done. You know, you're going to have a little slips and slides along the way and each day you get up, just make a conscious effort. You know, once you're aware of it, you'll make a change. But if you're not aware of it, you can't change something you are not aware of. So if you're aware of that, there is some ways, you know, you like to change and adjust, you know, throughout the day, each day. You make like a mental check towards those things. Whenever you see them pop up, you go, oh, 
there you go <laughs> and quiet it you know but you have to be present you have to be breathing that is so important you have to take deep inhale and breaths whenever you get in any tense situation if someone is anchoring you and you feel really upset and you know that rage and fire just build up inside of you take some breaths just breathe you know and calm down this say it, it, it's not it's not it's not worth it it is not that important just breathe count your breaths and think about something else other than that person at that situation so <clears throat> share with me how do you cope throughout the day because dealing with people it is not easy everyone has their own little characters and when we say characters being in one person have multiple personality okay so imagine you're dealing with that <laughs> It's a lot to deal with, but when you look at it within that terms and you know not to take the shift and change of that individual personal and attach it to you, it can differentiate and create that wall, you know, that barrier. So, you know, but it's something you have to work on because then if you take everything personal and somebody, something, something, somebody said to you just angers you to the point where you have to flare up and you have to answer and you have to argue you know you have to work on toning that down just try not to say anything even when it's like right there on the tip of your tongue say this is a mental practice i am not for this week i am not going to say anything if someone pisses me off i'm not going to answer i'm not going to get upset i'm not going to get angry I'm just gonna, you know, breathe. <laughs> Try it. And then it will become a conscious reminder and you will do it every day and you're gonna find that your level of peace. Nice, you know? So, that is it. I just wanna come on here and uh, tell you about the sales for July because I always do not get YouTube in like if you follow me on Instagram you're gonna see announcement and everyday you know kind of activity going on there but YouTube I have to like really get in the mood and come and sit and talk to the camera and have something to talk about <laughs> you know and in the mood to talk so I always don't get you guys in on the action and I wanted to make it a conscious effort and I'm thinking it's about time to do a giveaway so I will be doing a giveaway and let me know what most you're like what are you interested in the giveaway are you interested in hair products skin products or a combination of both so that I can put this little box together for a nice little giveaway for the year so there is a giveaway coming so tell me what you'd like most in this giveaway and do you see how my hair is flourishing <laughs> but much love and thanks for watching and remember breathe keep the peace keep the calm you know all that anger is not good for us Keep a good positive vibration yes every now and then somebody is going to take you out of character and that is okay we're human you know we slip up we make mistakes because when you think about it we have been conditioned for so many years being like this and now we want to be like this you know so it's gonna take a while if we uh, climb up that ladder so baby steps and enjoy the process because you're getting to know yourself so much love